back a little while ago. I, I actually went and got to go and test the car with Sebastian Loeb. So, um, yeah, that was an amazing day and a, an experience of a lifetime. It's uh, not too many people get in to jump in beside him. And, um, yeah, that man can really wheel a car. It's, uh, yeah, I've never, never been so quite close to the edge of being scared in my life in that rally car. He, uh, he definitely knew every little bit part of the track. And, um, yeah, it's once in a lifetime chance that I, I've got to got to do and, and live out. And um, I definitely know there's some uh, some jealous people out there that have uh, talked to me about this and wish they were in that same position. But, uh, yeah, really good guy. And, um, yeah, I'm hoping him, well, wishing him all the best for the race here uh, in Dakar. And um, he's not too far off. It's uh, still five days to go. Anything can happen. And, um, yeah, hopefully he can push and, and keep to, going towards the front. Well, you know, in all fairness, though, you were actually scared shitless when you were just sitting beside him. In all honesty, yes. I, I was trying to talk it up a little bit that I was in, yeah, in comfort and no problem. But, yeah, I, I definitely thought, yeah, this would be nice. It would be like a bit more, a little bit faster than a Sunday drive. And, um, yeah, I think he, he threw the whole week at me, I think. So, uh, yeah, it was, uh, it was a ride of a lifetime. And, um, yeah, I, I definitely didn't want to get out of the car. But when I was in it, I was, yeah, I was quite on edge and quite scared. But uh, the man, man, like I said, he can wheel a car and he's definitely... Uh, Definitely a legend all around and um, in all the sports he's done, and it, it's it's cool. Well, like yourself, thank you very much for your time. Go have lunch. Cheers. No